Hey, what's up? My name is David, and I'm going to share with you today how to buy Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin uh, quickly, efficiently, and really in the smartest way possible, too. So I'm going to give you uh, a practical understanding of how to buy it and own it, and uh, even a few tips on storing it if you'd like. And I'm also going to share with you when the best time to buy is so that you are buying uh, as a smarter investor as opposed to just jumping in the market at any time. Uh, and, and making a mistake like I have before. So I've, I've learned my lesson. And uh, <laughs> now one of the, the coins that I bought, I just have to wait for it to come back up. So uh, I use personally a website or a service called Coinbase, as you can see right here. Uh, Coinbase is sort of the PayPal, if you will, or I mean, I guess it's hard to describe compared to PayPal, but it's basically one of the, it's the biggest commercial uh, way or it's the biggest commercial company that allows you sort of ease of access to buy Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin. Um, my recommendation is to buy and hold all three uh, and buying at the right times is really important also. So first I'm just going to show you how to buy them. So when you set up an account, this is what your dashboard is going to look like. It's going to have uh, each of the charts and you know what they're doing, where the markets are at. And then if you click buy sell right here, all you're going to do, I don't know why that's there, uh, all you're going to do is just click which one you want to buy and then you are going to have your bank or your uh, credit card or your PayPal set up or whatever that may be. Uh, you can actually buy through PayPal also. Uh, as you can see here, I have a $25,000 weekly limit. So uh, yeah, I've done, the reason I have that is because I added my photo ID and I added all these different things. So basically you just put in how much you wanna buy. So if you wanna buy, uh, you, can, you, you can enter an either or. So if you wanna buy $5,000 worth, you just put $5,000 there. Whoops, that's too much. 5,000 and that's where that's 90.194 uh, etc cetera, etc cetera, Litecoin so you can do it that way or if you want to buy a specific amount of Litecoin you could say I want 10 Litecoin and that's going to populate auto populate your US dollar um, you know purchase you can also repeat the buy week, daily weekly every two weeks monthly uh, kind of like automated investing into the stock market if you would like to um, that's an A-OK -okay idea. The only downside is that if you're buying when the market is high and it takes a huge dip, uh, you're, you're automatically losing 20-30%. So I actually don't recommend doing that. So uh, it's really as simple as that. Your payment method is going to show up here. You're just going to hit uh, buy Litecoin. You're going to hit that. And what's going to happen is you're just going to hit confirm buy and then it's going to buy. I'm not going to buy right now, but uh, it's really that simple. So you can do that for Ethereum, Bitcoin, and Litecoin. Ethereum looks like it just hit $300. Uh, during this video and Bitcoin's been going up. They've all been going up lately, uh, Ethereum and Bitcoin especially lately, but Litecoin slowly but surely. Uh, so anyways, these are, that's, it's really that simple. And if you want to sell, you just hit sell and you select uh, which wallet you want to sell from and where you want it to be deposited and how much you want to sell. And then you just hit sell Bitcoin. It's really that simple. The reason I'm creating this video is for two reasons. One, to show you how to buy with Coinbase. It's really that simple uh, to get into the Bitcoin, Ethereum or Litecoin markets. And uh, secondly, to give you $10 in free Bitcoin. Uh, if you're buying $100 in Bitcoin or more, you're gonna get $10 in free Bitcoin simply by using my Coinbase referral link. So uh, let's be honest, I'm acting out of uh, self-interest here, uh, but you're gonna benefit because you're gonna get $10 in free Bitcoin. So if you wanna get into the Bitcoin, Ethereum, or Litecoin markets, all you have to do is go through the process I just showed you, Click the link right below this video and it's gonna give you $10 in free Bitcoin when you make your first purchase and sign up with Coinbase. So in order to more, uh, to get you closer or to convince you uh, that you should uh, you know, get into the Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin market, uh, I wanna share my story briefly. So uh, I bought my first Bitcoin about a year and seven months ago. Uh, I knew about Bitcoin initially in 2012. Uh, Bitcoin in 2012 was about uh, $12, $13 a coin. And uh, at that point in my life, I actually invested in other things and those things did not work out. And I did some math and I, I calculated that if I put, if I invested $10,000 into Bitcoin in 2012, that would have been worth something like over $4 million today. Uh, and that's just Bitcoin. That's not Ethereum, Litecoin, you know, other, other investments as well. Uh, I bought Ethereum, uh, my first Ethereum at $17 and right now it's $298. Uh, so I, I put like a thousand dollars in, seventeen bucks a coin, uh, a token, and, and now it's at two ninety eight. So that's uh, you know like tw almost twenty x, twenty times uh, you know um, ROI, twenty times on the money, which is just crazy. 
Um, well, it's my, it's almost 20, it's like 17 times or whatever. But anyways, it's a great game. And then Litecoin, uh, it's, it hasn't grown as much, but I, I definitely think there's potential there. A lot of people would like coin, call Litecoin the silver to Bitcoin's gold. So think of Bitcoin as like the gold standard. Think of Litecoin as like the silver standard, if you will. Uh, and if, if you don't understand the technology, the technology is really valuable. Uh, Litecoin, Ethereum, and Bitcoin all play different roles in the market. So Bitcoin is more of a, is, has sort of become more of a store of value. Uh, and it, some retailers do accept Bitcoin as a form of payment. Ethereum is built off of smart contracts. So anything to do with like uh, the legal world or tracking numbers and data uh, and building contracts between uh, corporations and people or people and people or corporations and corporations. Ethereum is going to play a huge role in that. And then Litecoin uh, may just be a, a cryptocurrency that uh, has the quickest, fastest uh, ease of use and scales best. So they all have their own you know, kind of aim in the market and as, as well as other cryptocurrencies. Uh, but these are the three biggest uh, uh, main cryptocurrencies and that's why Coinbase sells them. There are others in the market as well, which I'm about to show you. But these, I would just buy and hold at the right time. And I'm gonna explain why and, uh, well, I kind of explain why it's disrupting uh, the space and finance, it's disrupting the legal world, it's disrupting, uh, it's, it's going to disrupt the world of IoT, Internet of Things, uh, because uh, all of these uh, things, all these physical objects in the world, whether it's your refrigerator or your, uh, your, your, your washer, dryer, they're all going to connect to the blockchain and they're all going to uh, work off of smart contracts. Uh, so uh, utilizing you know, efficient smart, contract, smart contracts and microtransactions at the very, very micro level, uh, this is all going to be integrated into society at some point. So we're just... We're waiting for scalability to uh, occur uh, because Visa transactions uh, are much, there's a much higher ratio with Visa transactions. So Visa can process like, I don't know, I think it's like 8,000 transactions a second where Bitcoin is like eight. So this is all still in its infancy. So if you think it's too early to get in, it's definitely not. Uh, some people think that Bitcoin could be the world reserve currency at some point. Uh, which would just be absolutely insane and, and it, 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 the price would absolutely ins explode if that would happen. So the market is still in its uh, infancy state and these things will build sort of the internet 2.0, a, a new way of working in the digital world and in the, in, the, in the physical connection to the IoT internet of things world. So there's a lot of potential here, I believe. And uh, what you want to do is buy through Coinbase, and I recommend storing in a hard wallet, so Ledger or the Trezor um, are two hard wallets, and they're just they kind of, they're kind of like USB drives. You put your cryptocurrencies on that, and you can just store it at home, or you know, in a safe deposit box at the bank, or wherever you want, wherever you want to keep that little device safe, because that stores it for you. Uh, so this website here is going to be a, re a valuable resource for you if you're getting into cryptocurrency and you're new to the space. It's called Coin Market Cap. Dot com and what this does is it shows the current price the 24-hour price chains and you can actually see all the charts so I can click on Bitcoin here and I can see uh, where Bitcoin is where it's been and uh, you know kind of like where it's going hopefully uh, so you can see the price you know back in you know uh, September 2013 $120 and so on and so forth so you can you can you can see you know year to date one year three months one month seven days one day so you can you can just take a closer look uh, you know, Bitcoin, Ethereum, uh, Ripple as well. Ripple, wow, Ripple spiked recently. 12% uh, up, that's cool. I have a little bit of Ripple. Uh, Bitcoin Cash and Litecoin. Uh, so you can see the market is, is very bullish right now. Uh, and uh, it's, it's very bullish. Uh, you can see the total market cap here, 141 billion. Uh, and all of the cryptocurrencies in the markets, uh, I most of these are crap. Most of the 1128 are absolute crap. Don't waste your time, money. Bitcoin, Ethereum, Ripple to some degree, uh, and Litecoin, uh, and Dash too. I think has some potential. And some of these others, some of the top and list, Monero. I think um, you know it. You really, it really just depends. But uh, Zcash, uh, it really just depends. But Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin uh, are really, you know, some of the biggest three in terms of market cap. Not the biggest overall, but really some of the biggest three. And they have different applications in different spaces uh, for different uses. So uh, I do recommend owning each of those. Uh, and you want to buy when these are green, or excuse me, when these are red, sorry. So right now they're green. Right now there's it's bullish. The market's been bullish. 
So if you start to watch uh, the entire market, what happens is the entire market fluctuates. So it'll go up, down, up, down, it's waves. And it'll literally fluctuate 10, 20, 30%. It's, it's, very, it's a very wavy, choppy market. Um, so you don't wanna buy when everything's green, um, like right now. Uh, at the same time, uh, Litecoin, for example, hit $95 recently, and right now it's 53. Uh, so it's just getting into that bullish state. So right now it might be an actual, a really good time to buy Litecoin because it's just starting to become bullish again from this, this bearish uh, period of like two weeks where it came down from $95. So, you, you know, there's different times and, you know, it's not all whether it's green or red because right now the market is starting to become bullish. Uh, again in certain ways. So you just have to you know kind of do your own kind of research and look into it uh, This website is also valuable bitcoinwisdom.com shows you maps for Bitcoin Litecoin Ethereum And if you want to look at the uh, candlestick charts, you can do that and really get into the nitty-gritty of things So those are valuable resources uh, coin market cap as well uh, And then obviously coinbase so uh, and you can also see the charts in here, too um, and you know a year chart and that kind of thing and and where it's at in the past week in the past month as you can see in the past month like i was saying for litecoin look at this it was 90 90 it was 91 it says 91 here but i i, saw, I remember hitting 95. so it did get up to over 90 and right now it's only 54 and it dipped down to like 30 40. so right now it's still i mean there's you know there's room for growth and the price has gone there before. So, you know, it, it can go there again. So anyways, Litecoin, Ethereum, Bitcoin, uh, buy some uh, in Coinbase. I'm going to put my referral link below, click that link, just spend a hundred bucks, get in the market, Litecoin, Bitcoin, Ethereum. Uh, you can hold it in Coinbase to start if it's only like a couple hundred bucks or whatever. Uh, and hopefully this video is helpful in getting you acclimated and getting your first Bitcoin, Ethereum and Litecoin. Uh, see you in the next video.